Hi, I'm Jason from the company Block Out Blinds and I hope you're having a fantastic day. Today I'm going to be talking about what blinds you can put on your sliding doors. Now what blinds can you put on your sliding doors? Well, pretty much you can put any blind you like, however, some are not as practical as others. I'll go through a few examples. Here we have uh, a photo of a couple of timber Venetian blinds over a vertical door. It's been split in two so that one side can be lifted up for uh, easy access to get in and out with that while leaving the second side down. Now while this works, um, you've got height restrictions. As you can see, the blind on the right hangs quite low, so you won't have to duck if you're tall. And it's quite cumbersome lifting a Venetian blind that's quite heavy up and down every time you want to go in. Uh, in this next photo here, you can see some roller blinds over some sliding doors, which once again, probably a little bit better than having a Venetian blind. They're a lot quicker to roll up and down. There's no really weight involved. But still, you've got to lift them up and down to go in and out. So what most people prefer um, is some type of blind which slides in the same direction as the sliding door so that you can just slide the blind open, get out the door and slide the blind shut. Because what you also need to consider is when you're coming back inside through your sliding doors, if the blinds are down already, you need to be able to open them. Now with the roller blind and the Venetian that you just saw, it's going to be quite difficult because somehow you're going to have to reach around inside of the room and lift the blind up or down. Pain in the bum. So let's have a look at some other options. Well, the, um, what one that was you know, popular for quite some time, as you can see here in this photo, is a vertical blind. Uh, great option, very practical. The louvers can twist to let light in and out. And also you can just pull the, the cord at the side and slide the blind back to get in and out. But a lot of people don't like vertical blinds, funny enough. So let's have a look at our next option here, which is a picture of some, uh, a panel glide over a centre opening sliding door. And as you can see, this panel glide, it'll slide to the left and slide to the right. And very easy to get in and out. Also, probably, a, I don't know, a bit more modern looking than the, the good old uh, vertical blind. Then, last but not least, the good old plantation shutter, as you can see in this photo here. Here in this photo, the plantation shutter has four panels. Uh, two on the left and two on the right, and the two on the left and right are, are, are sort of joined to make one panel. Um, and here it's in the closed position, and basically either of these panels can slide left or right to get access to either side of the door. Now here in the next picture, you can see the, the same shutters on the same window, except now um, the right panel is being slid back to allow access to come in and out the door. Once again, these are a fantastic option. So what I'm really trying to say is when it comes to sliding doors, the more practical options are one, your vertical blind, vertical blind, two, your panel glide, and three, the plantation shutter. And how much do these cost? Well, pretty much I've listed them from the least expensive to the most expensive, with the plantation shutter being the, the bee's knees of blinds, if you want to like to put it like that. So there you go. Now you know what's best to put on your sliding door and what to consider. So uh, if you have a sliding door, now you know exactly what you need. So once again, I, I hope I've helped you out and till next time.